When I see the statue, I think of one word, justice. This is an example of a community making art for itself. This is funded locally, uh, this is being done by a local artist, and it's celebrating a moment that is important in the history of our community. I'm a big believer we have to keep our past alive in the present, especially those uh, pivotal moments. And there's no doubt that this activity of, of the civil rights movement continues to be significant for our country. We still haven't healed all the wounds, we still haven't achieved the degree of justice that we need. I think this uh, replication of that iconic picture will allow the next generation of people in our community to look back and to realize how pivotal that moment was in our collective history. To me, it's gonna mean that St. Joe County, South Bend, Indiana, celebrates the life of Dr. Martin Luther King and believe in his legacy of freedom, justice, righteousness, and fairness that our city believes in that, and that they're, well, you know, putting your money where your mouth feels. You're, we're gonna do that statue, and I feel, I feel honored, I feel appreciated that it's going to happen. I think it's awesome, I really do. The positioning of this monument is going to be very important as well. You know, you have Dr. King and Father Ted arm in arm demanding justice, and the way that their position will be looking onto the county courthouse, which is the seat of justice in our community. We also think this will be an interactive monument. Uh, this invites the viewer to stand, literally arm in arm with Dr. King and Father Ted. I am so thrilled that many of the kids throughout the community, all of our elementary schools and surrounding communities can come and be a part of that. We can take pictures, we can hold hands with them, and we can talk to them and we can live by what they believed in, as well as what we believe in and what's right for our community. And so we're asking people to be part of this growing tradition of great public art in the heart of the city. It's also a chance to contribute to something that's meaningful, something that'll be a gathering place for people of, I think, all backgrounds and ages who are in the heart of the city, but it's not something we can do alone. And so we're really counting on the community, on everybody who cares about our downtown, cares about the story, cares about history and that past, present, and future to consider giving to something like this. Well, I'm just, I'm just proud. I'm proud that they're going to do it. And I, I'm just proud to be a part of it, to, to be in my day that I can see that and see that our community celebrates the legacy of what Dr. Martin Luther King believed in. It is not only for today, it is not only celebrating Dr. Martin Luther King's birthday, but it's something celebrated that we wish for throughout the entire world. Justice, peace, as well as harmony.